Good morning! Welcome to day four of December and Advent and Vlogmas and whatever. Um, <laughs> it is the second Advent Sunday already, which is very weird because it's only the 4th of December. But uh, yeah, it is. So I'm going to open my hobby Advent calendar later. But I did bring my book, my Advent book, and I'm going to open that now. So let's see if the thriller streak continues on or if we will change genres. Um, it didn't say all thrillers, so I have no idea what it's in here. It doesn't matter. I basically like everything. I The only thing I don't read is science fiction. So... Okay, we're out of thriller territory, I think. It's by Chody Pico. Pico? It's called 19 Minutes. Oh, well, okay, maybe it is a thriller after all. Because, you know, when you read that, it does sound quite thrillery. Mm, okay, the first sentence on the back says, As a midwife, Lacey Houghton brings life into the world. She didn't expect her son to take them away. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess it is another thriller, but this one looks like it's absolutely not been used before. You know, it's uh, it even has a sticker on it. I'm guessing it's from a flea market or something, but I don't care. It looks brand new, unused, unread. It's very long. It's a very thick one. Yes. So this one I'm super excited about. I'm excited about all of them, let's face it, but this one so far I think might be my favorite. And while we're still sitting here, I wanted to show you my very well co color coordinated project. I mean, don't you think it's perfection? I think so. I am um, started my day working on the blanket for the kid. I have this much left now. Not a whole lot, but you know, it's still a bit there. And then I get to enter the next skein. I brought one to show you. So this will come after that. Yeah, and then I plan today on staying downstairs in my studio for a while, work on my um, Christmas blanket. And um, I want to finish some things so I can start a commission. And I am going to watch Criminal Minds. I have my, my mind is set. That is going to happen today. Because I want it to happen today. I hope, I hope, I hope that this will also work out. You know, you'll never know. So I'm going to show you what Tony did tonight. And then I am going to have another cup of coffee, I think. So this is the chocolate bread I made yesterday. And my son looked at it and said, ah, I bet Tony is going to have a bite tonight. So, of course, I took that. And he did have a bite. And he left some crumbs and a little um, letter or a note saying, um, thanks for the idea. It's really good. So <laughs> that's what I did. And now I'm going to cut this up and put it in a tin. And I'm going to have a, a bit. I mean, I already had a bite yesterday and it was really good. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm super happy with that. We'll see how long it lasts. downstairs to my studio and I'm going to open this little package in a minute but I also brought my crochet blanket because I really want to finish that and start this one I brought a plate full of cookies and no I did not make them I only made the chocolate bread the other ones are from a friend from my mom and I just wanted to show you what the chocolate bread looks like it is the best thing ever so I'm looking forward to that and here is my advent blanket 
I'm this far in. I am going to work on this as well. So I plan on being here crocheting on my blankets. I should also work on this Niklaus stocking over there. So I'm not going to get bored, you know. And before we do all of that, we are going to open the second little box from the Hobby Advent Calendar. This is a Advent Sunday calendar where you got four boxes. The first box had four skeins of acrylic yarn and the patterns were for um, small ornaments that you can make. Now this one, I don't know yet. Let's find out together. Ooh, I think I like that. Open up. I really think I like that a lot. What is it? Rainbow eight ply sock wool. That's wonderful. Um, the pattern that um, came per email this morning was for a pair of slippers, colorwork slippers. I think this is the perfect yarn for it. Now, what is this? What are you? Ooh. Okay, it's a hundred percent wool, but as you can see, this is kind of scratchy. Not sure yet what I want to make with this. It looks, it looks as scratch. It is as scratchy as it looks. So I'm definitely not going to buy more of that yarn. <laughs> and then we have ah labels. And what are you? Cards? Is it postcards? Oh yeah, it is postcards. They are very cute. So this is the hobby advent box for day two. And I'm really liking the yarn. And the slippers, not so sure, but the yarn I really like. And I will definitely find a project to use it for. So yay for that. And now I'm just gonna watch Criminal Minds. I already have it going. I just paused it so I can talk to you all. And I will sit here, eat my cookies, watch Criminal Minds and crochet and just be alone for a bit. <sighs> so I just had lunch and came downstairs again. I'm working on a blanket and I realized very early on that in the first row, I skipped the last stitch. From then on, it is straight, but you know, down here, not so much. So this will need a border in the end, I guess. <laughs> but I have started in this light red and there's, I have done the light red, There, then there's dark red, which you can't see because it's the, at the other end, and then white, light green, and I just entered the dark green. And I had a few spots now where the color is more white than color. And um, it's not, see here, there's one of those. It's not really that it totally bothers me, but here's the other instance. But I'm going to say I'm glad that I only paid 50% of the price. I don't enjoy things like this, you know, this, not a huge deal, but it does bother me a bit. So I'm back downstairs with myself a cup of fake coffee. This one is made from barley. Um, I also had rye and chicory in the past and I like all of them. It is basically my afternoon treat because I love coffee, but I cannot drink coffee all day long. So <laughs> I limit myself to two cups in the morning and then I have one of these every now and then and mainly drink tea. So yeah, I am still watching Criminal Minds. I'm going to continue with the crochet and my boys are getting the balconies ready for winter. So I just, I'm hiding here so I don't have to help, <laughs> which is kind of true, kind of not because um, there's just not enough room for three of us out there. So I am here doing this, which is much more enjoyable, I have to say. I've now arrived in my office and I am going to write the recipe for yesterday's cake. So um, that's going to be the last thing that I'm going to do today before reading, you know, so let's start.
I have just uploaded the recipe to Patreon with a gluten-free option in the text on my um, on the Patreon itself. And uh, I think that's it for me for today. I'm going to um, edit the video, get that uploaded, and then I will try to read more in my book. I really want to finish it. It is so good, but I could just keep dozing off in the evening. You know, I'm so tired lately because I've had very bad sleep. So we'll see how far I can get today, but I really want to finish it within the next three days at least. You know, it's, it's really good and I really want to read a lot more as well. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I will tell you all about it in tomorrow's vlog. See you. Good night.